guys, this tutorial I'm going to show you how to install Tract TV, add it to your Kodi to get the best experience. Uh, this is going to give you all your um, favorite TV shows all listed for you in Exodus. I've converted over to Exodus from Salts uh, because Exodus is uh, easier to use, more content, it's categorized a lot better, it has more integration. Uh, 80, over 80% 80 of Kodi users use Exodus and swear by Exodus. Um, now with Exodus and Track TV integration and Real Debrid TV, uh, this is as closest to cable television you're going to get uh, for the moment. So let me dive in and show you how to get this. So yours is going to look a little different than mine, but uh, I've kind of kept it the same. So what I need you to do is go to the TV section. In the TV section, go to Exodus TV. Okay, you're going to come up with this screen. I want you to hit this back arrow up here. Okay, I want you to hit it one time and then go to tools and then you're going to get your settings page. So in your settings page, I want you to hit general. Okay, you're going to switch the indicators to tracked. Yours right now will stay local, so go to tracked. And then I want you to go to latest episodes, go to tracked progress. Okay, make sure everything else looks the same as mine. Max quality, 1080p. I do want you to autoplay, so make sure the autoplay is still turned on. Uh, resume playback and playback info are highlighted. Okay, now in here is where you're going to do the tract. So this is pulling or synced to my tract. And how to get that is so yours is going to look like this okay so you're going to click on it it gives you this code right here what you need to do is you need to go to your computer or your iphone or your ipad and go to https colon forward slash forward slash track dot tv forward slash activate so i have mine just right here loaded up Okay, so this is my track TV. So first you need to, to make a user account and then you're just gonna go to activate and you're gonna type that code into here. So this code, Okay, so now my account is linked with Exodus. Perfect. So my account looks like this. Okay, really basic. The only thing you need to do is go into lists over here, make a new list, and have all your favorite TV shows in there. So I have 25 TV shows in here that are my favorite. Okay. So now you're going to see accounts, there's authorization for Track TV. Okay. So we're going to go down to OK. And now it's there. So now all my TV networks are up here. So these are all my TV shows that are in Track TV. So you're not going to have to go around, search for them, look for them every day. They're all up here in your favorites bar. Okay, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to put them up in that favorites bar. Okay, so this is step number two. You're going to go over to system. Enter into system. You're going to go up to skin. You're going to go to home menu. You're going to find TV. Click on TV. Go to videos menu. 
videos nodes, videos add-ons, Exodus. Yours is going to look exactly like mine. There's going to be no difference. I want you to go to my lists. And then TV show lists. There is my account from Track TV, so I'll just show you. Jeff. Jeff. So there's all my favorites. And then just name this TV. And you're there. Now to get them onto your home screen, you're going to go to widget set. You're going to go to TV node and that is going to make them all appear nice and clean. Now you got to go to submenu set and just click live TV. Okay, so yours should look exactly like this. All right, so now back out, go to TV. There's all your favorite TV shows. Okay, with matching album artwork, everything underneath. And then these are all your TV, your live TVs. There you go. That's how to uh, install Track TV and uh, into TV section. Okay, to do it for the movie section, uh, I personally don't do it to movies. I, I just have uh, Exodus pull up the latest movies, which is... Uh, which I'm going to show you right now. This is step three. You're going to go to system again. You're going to go to skin. Oops. Oops. Menu. I want you to go to movies. Click on movies. Click on videos menu. Videos nodes. Video add-ons, come down to Exodus, and go to latest movies. This is going to pull up all the latest movies. Just hit, they're not going to show there, but it's okay. Click OK. Type in movies. Now we want them to appear. Click on movies nodes. Then you got to set it, just click on movies. Now it's going to show you all your favorites or the latest movies in Exodus. Okay, that's step three. So now we've configured movies and we've configured TV to source Exodus, not salts. The reason why I'm saying that is because now you should have real debris. Real Debrid is a streaming source, which is real-debrid.com. Okay, in here, this is what you're going to have to pay for. Okay, pay for the premium service. Trust me, it works. This is not a gimmick. You're not going to. Your credit card's fine. Don't worry about that. You can pay with PayPal if you want. Uh, 16 euro, which is about $50, or sorry, $25 uh, for 180 days. So you're going to subscribe to this one. Uh, this is the one I would subscribe to. This is the one I have subscribed to. So you're just going to hit subscribe, pay by credit card, click pay, enter in your credit card information, process, done. It's all verified by Visa and MasterCard, so don't worry about it. Okay. Um, this service is going to give you the 1080p. It's going to stream a lot quicker. It's going to make it so that it's uh, that uh, you're going to have it just like cable television or just like if you were to rent it from iTunes or a movie or anything like that. Uh, Netflix, whatever. Netflix on steroids. That's what I like to call it. So realdebrid.com. You're going to sign up. You're going to get your activation code via email. Uh, 
once you sign up it's going to give you big whatever you call it okay so now what we're going to do so we're going to show you how to put it in so click on movies oops I'll show you the other way Exodus I want you to hit this arrow back once go to tools settings general this is the exact same part where you put in your authorization for track so there's mine Jeff Morton so you're gonna go down and you're gonna to go to real to Brit. okay so let's show you how this this works I'm gonna reset this okay so now I don't have real to Brit. okay it's not even linked to my account anymore so I'm gonna go back you stay where you are I'm gonna show you what happens let's go to Exodus movies let's go to latest movies you don't need to do this just what I'm just showing you how this works so in my other movie I had Zootopia the best quality I, I was getting was uh, 1080p there was like 15 streams of 1080p now the best I can get is HD which is 720 with a watermark so I want you just to keep keep tab tabs on what I'm doing here so this is I'm just showing you that Zootopia only comes in SD quality or HD quality if you don't have real debrid okay so let's go and add real debrid so I'm gonna to go to Exodus movies I'm just going back to where you guys are right now okay click on authorization gives you your code So you're going to go to https colon forward slash forward slash real dash debrid.com and then forward slash device and then you're going to enter in your code so i'm just going to add forward slash device so just like track tv you're entering in a code so that they link up together Click yes, you want to allow. Now they're linked up. Okay, so here you're going to see accounts, and then there's the password put in. It's 12 o'clock. Click, make sure you click OK, and then just go back. Now I'm going to go back. what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go to tools for a second I'm going to clear my providers just to get those 720p's out of there and I'm going to clear the cache as well just so I have a clean slate I'm working with so I'm going to click into Exodus I'm going to go to the latest movies we're going to go to Zootopia again okay so we'll see how many 1080p streams it pulls up as you see this is live I'm not doing anything so remember there is one HD and all SDs now there's one two three all the way down 15 1080p versions that real debris is pulling in okay and then on top of that it's pulling in another 20 HD versions and then the SD versions that Exodus had okay which there's even more because of real to Brit so no matter what you're gonna get the best quality let's just look at uh, another movie here let's look at uh, one that's still in theater London has fallen okay the I couldn't even really get this before now you've got all 1080p versions all the way up to 10 so you have 10 1080p 
P versions of this movie that is still in the theater. Okay, just for shits and giggles, we'll play, we'll try one more. Uh, let's do Deadpool, since it's a killer movie. And it's still in the theater right now, so, uh, but you can get this on iTunes right now, so there should be 1080p versions. So obviously there's a ton of 1080p versions of it now, so 19 of them. All right, so that is how you link the uh, Real Debrid to Exodus, okay? So now all the movies, because we put it in, imported it into Real Debrid into Exodus, all your TV shows and everything are gonna be the exact same as well. So if we take, well, let's just go to our list. Make it easy. So my list up here, let's take, uh, say, try something different. Yeah, let's do true to, oops. True Detective, or Empire, let's try that. Empire, season two, let's use the second last one. You have autoplay on, so you can just hit enter, but I'm just showing you how many streams there are. Okay, so Real Debrid, the maximum stream it can get is 720p, okay? Which is perfectly fine for television. If we're looking at, uh, let's say, Narcos. You know, if you're doing a movie from like Netflix or you're doing a movie from uh, HBO or something like that, then you're gonna get them in better quality. You know, if they're pulling from ABC or CBS or anything like that, who cares? Okay, so HD, let's see, uh, 1.6 gigs. Let's see the quality of this. <clears throat> As you can see, it takes no time at all to load now. So 720p, 5.1, wicked. Okay, so that is Trap TV integrated with your Exodus. Uh, how to link Track TV to your TV on Exodus your movies, movies with Track TV, and your Real to Brit. So that's a tutorial on how to get that done. If you guys have any questions, let me know. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. Thank you.